can see some of the sparkles. Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a quick little makeup eyeshadow tutorial on the Soft Glam Anastasia of Beverly Hills palette. This is like one of my favorite palettes. I rotate between this and Tartlet and Bloom probably every other day. Um, it's just got a lot of really like um, rosy tones and like warm tones and it just goes really good with my eye color. So if you don't have it, I recommend you pick it up. And without further ado, let's get into the video. So I already have the majority of my base on, basically lips, foundation, concealer, basically the majority of it. So let's just get right into it. So you guys all know that I like to start with the center of my lid and then work my way out, but for this particular look, I'm actually going to be starting with the transition color, like mostly everyone does. <laughs> so we're gonna be starting with Burnt Orange, it's this one, and using that as basically your transition. Next, I'm going to use this same color and go along my lower lash line just to join and connect out here. You want to kind of make like a, a wing shape outwards. Next, I'm going to take the color Rustic. It's this brown, and I'm going to put it all over my lid, kind of blend it into the crease. We're also going to add Rustic to the bottom lower lash line. Add black eyeliner. I like to do the liner before I do the outer corners of my eyes just because it kind of gives me a guideline of where I want the shadow to go on the outside. We're going to be taking Cypress Umber. It's this really dark colored brown. And we're going to be putting it on the outside of the corner of the lid. You kind of just want to dab it on because you want it to be dark and not as blended. Blend out the crease only so it doesn't look crazy. <laughs> Next, with a very gentle hand, we're going to be taking the same color and doing it on the lower lash line. Very gentle. Just to kind of add some pink tones to kind of match the lipstick, I'm going to be taking Sultry, which is this color right here, with a wet brush and dabbing it on kind of the middle to inner corner of the lid. Even though it's technically not a pink lipstick, it kind of has pink undertones. Must wet the brush, otherwise the product will not stick. Should look something like this when we're almost done. You can see some of the sparkles. Just take a regular fluffy brush and you're going to take Tempura, which is like this highlighter, tannish white color, and we're just going to do brow bone with it. And for the final touch, everybody knows that I like to put highlighter in the corner of my eyes. kind of just brightens them up from all angles. So I'm going to be taking my usual Becca in Opal and just putting that in the corner of my lid, actually in the corner of my eyes. 
Before I go and finish my mascara, powder, basically all the rest of the essentials, I am going to use a white eyeliner today. This one is from Stila Styla. I don't really know how to say it, but it's the white one from there. I like to do this just to make my eyes look a little bit bigger. Normally with a look like this, I will do a dark liner, like a black liner or a dark brown. But for today, I'm going to do white just because it's daytime and I don't really want to walk around with like a super smoky eye. <laughs> Should look something like this. All right, now I'm gonna finish everything and I'll be back. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little video. If you do, please feel free to give it a thumbs up down below and please subscribe. I'm new to YouTube, so any help I can get, the more the merrier. I'll see you guys soon, bye.